Hello widget watchers, I guess you are doing well like this video, so in this video we will learn about how some apps showing this confetti animation or let's say this celebration animation when you complete some task or some event happens in the app. So here I have this empty project and for adding the confetti animation in the app, first come to the pubspec.yaml file, and here you need to add this confetti package, then tap on this pub get button to get this package in the project. Now come to the main.dart file and here inside this state class first create a controller variable of type confetti controller, then here add init state method and inside this method initialize this controller variable with confetti controller, and this needs a duration parameter, so here I am passing this duration of 2 seconds. So this means the confetti animation will run for 2 seconds. Then below this init state method create a dispose method and inside this method dispose this controller variable. Now come to the build method and here inside this center widget add a stack widget, and inside this stack widget first add elevated button widget, and this button will be used to show the confetti animation, so here for the child property of this button widget add a text widget with text show confetti. And for the on pressed property of this button widget call a show confetti method. Now let's create this show confetti method, now come inside this method and here call this controller variable and call this play method. So this will play the confetti animation when this button is pressed. Now below this button widget add first add align widget, and sets its alignment to center, and inside this align widget add confetti widget, and this widget needs a confetti controller, so here pass this controller variable, then here we need to pass the blast directionality property, so here I am passing explosive, so this means the confetti will blast in an explosive way, then set should loop to false so that the confetti animation will not loop, then for the colors property pass a list of colors. So here I am passing some colors, so this will be the colors of the confetti, these are the colors that will be shown in the confetti animation. Now this was it, now save the code and you can see the button is in odd position, so let's fix this, so come to the stack widget and wrap this button widget with center widget, now save the code and you can see the button is in the center of the screen, now tap onto this button and yay, we have the desired animation. Now here the confetti animation is coming above this button. But you can change this by changing the order of these widgets in the stack widget. So here I've changed the order of these widgets, now save the code and you can see the button is above the confetti animation. So this was it, this is how you can add this confetti animation in the app, so if you found this video helpful please like this video, and for more such videos please subscribe to Widget Wisdom.